One thing Knox and I have been doing that's been awesome with engaging him and having conversations is we have been talking every day about our favorite things that happened that day. And I'll say my favorite thing today was playing with our Thomas trains. What was your favorite thing? And he'll say, my favorite thing was... <laughs> trying to stay engaged. My brain's going a mile a minute and his is just taking his time really thinking about all the things that happened that day. And so he might say, you know, he probably would say, giving you a hug, mom. I'd be like, yeah, I know. <laughs> and if anything funny happens that day, we call it a funny story. And we retell that funny story all day long. Who wants to tell a funny story? You do. I do? Yeah. Okay, you're gonna help me? No. No. What funny story do you wanna tell? The pharmacy. The pharmacy? Yeah. What, can, what happened? I was going to get some paper towels for Miss Barbara. Yeah. And then what happened? You found them. I found them? Yeah. Did I pull one off the shelf? Yeah. And what happened? All of them fell down. <laughs> you know, obviously the first thing you do when something like that happens is you look around to see if anyone's looking at you, which I don't know why you do that. And then I look at Knox and he goes, Knox said, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Yikes. Yikes. <laughs> I don't know why, but it was the funniest thing he could have said. And we laughed and laughed and we cleaned up the mess. And on the walk home, Knox said, Mom, what happened at the pharmacy? And so I said, oh, this funny story I told him. Then at lunch, he said, Mama, what happened at the pharmacy today? And so it was our funny story. Jared came home that night and um, Knox said, Daddy, can you tell me the story of the pharmacy? And Jared's like, what the heck happened at the pharmacy? But really, talking about every day our favorite things has been a great positive way to talk to, you know, do memory recall and to talk to each other. And it's actually something I've really started looking forward to. Sometimes before bed, he'll say, I want you to tell me a story. We're like, Three Little Pigs? No, what happened at the pharmacy? And it's something that we shared. It's an event Knox and I shared together that he now remembers, and it was really fun. And so actually telling funny stories to each other has been just one of the highlights of being a parent so far. Leave a comment in the comments below. Make sure to check me out on Twitter and Facebook at The Baby Book. And thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe. You don't want to miss one of these stories. <laughs> Bye, buddy. Bye, buddy. Here's your hat. <laughs>